Tyshawn Samuel, better known as Debo, is a standout wide receiver for the University of South Carolina. But his story is about more than his production on the field. It's about missing a loved one and a dream coming true. About facing adversity and battling back. The situations I've been through make me a stronger and better person. That's why I come out here and take advantage of every opportunity I get, because tomorrow I ain't promised. When Debo was a sophomore in high school, his brother Quan was sentenced to a year in prison for attempted burglary. Following his release in 2014, Quan was placed back in prison just one year later. What you can do is, you know, just try to keep going. Don't let that get in the way of nothing that you are trying to achieve in your life. The street life made my brother uh, make the decisions that he made, and he showed me the way, like, this is not the lifestyle to live. Learning from his brother's mistakes, Debo focused his attention to football and was committed to playing on a bigger stage. He always had told me in his life he wanted to play football on TV. I told him, hey, don't let nothing get in your way. Tyshawn was a beast on the field. I used to call him Sweet Feet. And I asked him, I said, Tyshawn, why you run so fast? Like, they ain't talking about it. I don't want nobody hitting me. <laughs> I want to thank God, my family, friends, coaches, teammates, and all the coaches that had interested me. Now I make my selection, University of South Carolina. On September 3rd, 2015, his dream of playing on TV finally came true. Here's Debo Samuel. As he fights his way out. Fumble ball is down. Looked like South Carolina was able to recover it. Samuel was fighting for a little something extra. The fumble wasn't the lowest point of Debo's first game. He strained his hamstring and missed seven games of the season. In the final game of the year, Debo returned as an offensive weapon for the Gamecocks. Throwing right side, Debo one-handed. Caught, touchdown Carolina. Touchdown Debo Samuel. The first of his career, and this one's from seven yards out in the rivalry game. That one-hand catch over there in the back of the end zone, I was happy. I was very proud of him. When he caught that touchdown, I think everybody knew we got something. Debo was determined to have a breakout sophomore season. But on the first play of the second game, he met adversity once again. His running back is A.J. Turner, and he wants to go deep on the first play, and it's overthrown. Intended for Debo Samuel, who pulled up, had his hand on his hamstring like he may have hurt himself. And I was like, oh my god, why does this keep happening? I was getting real down. I was like, man, I, I don't know if I still want to play. It's a tough feeling to see your child and their dreams are right there at their grasp and then they feel like it's, it's over with. That, that broke my heart. And I told him, I said, we're going to pray. You didn't come this far for it to be over with. As soon as he kind of got over that initial phase, which didn't last very long, then he's like, all right, I'm ready to go. I want to get back. I want to do whatever I need to do to get back. Come on in. That's it, good. Certainly supported him to get him back on the field, and he made a difference in our football team in the second half of the year. A little pressure off the edge, goes downfield. What a catch by Debo Samuel. Looking for Samuel on the slant, he's got him. I said, I told you prayer worked on it. I told you. I knew you was coming back. I told you don't give up. If he goes to the next level, that's going to be his job. Don't be trying to take care of everybody. But he wants to. He wants to look out for his family. I walk out there, and I was just looking around. I was like, this is what I wish for. It's like a dream come true. The situations I've been through make me a stronger and better person. That's why I come out here and take advantage of every opportunity I get, because tomorrow I ain't promised.
said you were the most versatile wide receiver in the draft. Why do you say that? Um, not only am I a receiver, but you can put me anywhere out there on the field. Like, I scored in every aspect of the game, throwing, pat, I mean, throwing, running, I mean, recovering fumbles, like I did it all. Do you play primarily in the slot? Is that where you see yourself in the NFL? Or are you uh, in the outside? What do you? I mean, I can play both of them. It really doesn't matter. But defense? I mean, good grief. <laughs> like, do it all, huh? Brown is now officially open. The Arizona Cardinals are on the clock. Debo. Yes, sir. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> you ready to be a Niner? Yes, sir. Yeah, we're fired up, man. We are really excited and uh, can't wait for you to get out here. You've worked really hard for this, man. We're really proud of you and uh, proud to have you as part of our family, okay? Yes, sir. With the 32nd pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the San Francisco 49ers select yes, Debo. <laughs> Uh, I was just like, hey, I'm, I'm officially a San Francisco 49er. Um, it was just a blessing to be here and just walking here, be a part of the team. Good. I want you to almost try and invite that guy to undercut. Good, G. There you go. Ready? Go. Woo. I'll let you know when we're done. All right, one more. All right. 2019 breakout wide receiver candidates and Niners fans are going to like this list because their second round draft pick is on it. Debo Samuel. He is on my list, and here's why. How do you replace a Pierre Garçon? You're going to get somebody that's built and can play just like him. Debo Samuel is that guy. There's no solidified number one receiver on the outside. Debo Sam Samuels, he's that guy. He can go out there and make it happen. Picked off. Here's Austin Walter. They're going to run an end around the other way here. And this is Debo Samuel. The other uh, gives you hope for the pass run. Yeah, I mean, both guys are amazing. Awesome up the edge, you know what I mean? I uh, have adding. 49ers on their 44. Bethard under center. A straight drop. Going to look big left sideline. Debo's out there. Did he reel it in? He did. Gets up. Watch him go up over the top. Now joined in the eye by Juszczyk. They're going to throw it. And to the end zone. Wide open it is a touchdown for the rookie Samuel. Down here in the red zone in the middle of the football field. And he goes in motion. The handoff is to Samuel. De Samuel is going to score. Debo Samuel. Pulls it out of the gun of Coleman and then finds Samuel. Debo Samuel, the rookie from South Carolina with a chunk play just short of midfield. Ten. And he connects here with Samuel. And that is the physicality and the tough play that they were looking for with Samuel. Hoping they can come up with a stop here, utilize those timeouts. Second and seven. As he gets it over to Samuel who gets free. And Garoppolo pumps, pumps, looks, trails, and finds. And here is Samuel. Play action, Garoppolo. In rhythm, midfield, Debo, Samuel, and more. Garoppolo has Debo Samuel. Passive yards. A third down. To Samuel and hits the first down. Fighting to the foul. Garoppolo as he throws a touch. As he throws and up in the air with a flag. Garoppolo to throw and a target to Samuel. Quick pass. Moving upfield to Samuel. Here, 13 0. Second and five, Garoppolo fires over the middle, come on, Samuel, the rookie is inside the 10, to the end zone, touchdown 49ers. Garoppolo has time, stands.
Edwards in. Going deep, going for it. Oh, and it's caught for the touchdown! On fourth down, Debo Samuel for six. First and ten from the 30. Garoppolo over the middle, and it's Samuel, the rookie. Debo Samuel inside the 10. And Garoppolo's coming. See if they get that going on the fake. Here comes Cameron Jordan. Garoppolo, another dart. Has a completion and another big one. It's Samuel, the rookie. Sweet. Garoppolo going to get it to Samuel again, trying to get to the edge. He does. Samuel on his way. Touchdown. about as fast as you can get in the football. And being a rookie and being on this huge stage, how has that been for you? I mean, it's just amazing. Just like as a kid growing up, you, you think about playing in the Super Bowl and dreams do come true. Here's a little toss to Debo Samuel over the right side. Big play. Still going. Mostert in the ball game. Here's another toss to Samuel. Looks like he wants to throw. Instead, he'll just pick it up with his legs. Here's a little push pass to Samuel. Another big run by the rookie. Garoppolo keeps, throws, good catch, Samuel, first down. Boy, that kid is tough. Here's Samuel again. Third time we've seen a similar play down the sideline with a big pickup for another first down. Fake the handoff, Garoppolo throws and completes for Samuel inside the 40. Oh, it's very disappointing, honestly. Um, we, we came here to do one thing and it didn't happen.